Welcome to Irix Guys Go Pro Videos. Please subscribe at youtube.com forward slash Irix Guy. Thank you. Hey everyone, Irix Guy here. Now what I'm holding in, in my hand is a shoebox containing everything that came within the uh, GoPro uh, caps and doors accessory pack. Now, you can watch my other video where I actually unbox that accessory pack, but in this video I'm going to show you what each item does. Uh, so for starters, with the GoPro HD Hero 3 in its case, and, and, and in this particular example I'm using HD Hero 3 Black Edition, uh, but this same, uh, this this will work with uh, HD Hero 3 White and Silver Editions as well. Uh, so one of the most important pieces that comes with this uh, caps and doors, in my opinion, is this little plastic piece right here. And when you look at the front of your GoPro camera, you notice that, notice that really nice and clean, flat lens surface. Well, what this does, this goes on that. So when you're, when you're uh, taking your uh, GoPro somewhere, you don't want sand or dirt or maybe other objects in your backpack when you're going through an airport, you know, phone chargers, those little sharp pieces that could scratch the, uh, the lens, this will better protect your camera. So that's a huge, that in itself, in my opinion, is a reason to buy the uh, GoPro HD Hero 3 caps and doors. Now we're going to, now we're going to remove uh, the GoPro HD Hero 3 from its case. You can see it's kind of extended now because I have the, uh, the L, uh, LCD touch display installed on it. And I always, out of good practice, always close my case as soon as I remove the GoPro. Uh, that prevents fur, dust, dirt, sand, whatever from getting in there and uh, potentially scratching your camera but also uh, degrading the uh, visual quality of your, uh, of your fine GoPro productions. So that brings us to the next little cap that came with caps and doors, and it's this thing. And if you're like me, you're probably like, well, what is this for? Do I put it on my eye? Do I put it on my nose? Do I put it in between my teeth? No, actually it serves a purpose, and it serves a purpose that is not immediately obvious. When you have your camera outside of its GoPro case, your HD Hero 3 camera, you notice that the lens is exposed. So you sit this on your desk, you're sinking it, you're charging it, you've got a big cat that jumps up, starts licking it, biting it, scratching it. Hey, problem solved. This little piece goes on that, so when your GoPro's out of its case, not only is it protected from scratches, it's protected from dust, just a great way to prolong your GoPro camera investment. Now in addition to that, the other pieces that come with the HD Hero 3 uh, caps and doors accessory pack, you get an extra one of these and all that is, and you can see here mine's missing so it's good I got this, a little extra side door to cover your, uh, your USB port and your micro SD card and HDMI ports right there extra one of these because they anticipate that people will lose them. And then likewise, the back door that covers the battery area, that of course comes with your HD Hero 3 camera, but this is an extra because that's something that would be easy to lose as well. And I'm not going to show it, it's, but it's under this uh, uh, under this LCD backpack. I don't want to take it off. So, so that's, it, it's, a good, uh, it's a good investment. I mean, it's a few bucks. You can get it from GoPro.com. I, I really wish they had included that with the camera. And, and I say that because, for example, when I got the LCD uh, Touch Backpack GoPro accessory, it came with a nice little carrying case for the, uh, for the Touch Backpack. Why couldn't they have included those two extra pieces of plastic, pieces of plastic rather, with the HD Hero 3 camera? Especially the Black Edition, it costs so much. I mean, you know, put that... Put that thing that covers the front of the case, put that thing that covers the uh, lens on the camera itself, you know. But looking at it from a marketing perspective, I can see why they may not want to. And the reason being is that, uh, well, number one, they're going to sell more accessories. And if they don't sell those accessories, the likelihood of somebody damaging their case and or their camera lens increases, which increases their likelihood of maybe selling replacement parts. Anyway, I'm not saying GoPro is not out for our best interest. I love GoPro. I love their products, but I just want to point that out. 
if I was running GoPro, I would have included those two uh, uh, those two covers, and maybe it offered as a as an as an after add-on, maybe some really fancy looking cover just to try to get people to buy it. But anyway, that's a moot point. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. It's youtube.com forward slash irixguy. Got a lot of new uh, GoPro videos coming, a lot of action videos. I know I've had a lot of review videos, but I just want to put out there, uh, review the products, explain how the products work, and then put the products to the test. Thanks for tuning in and y'all have a good day.